Welcome to the Backwoods Gourmet. Today I'm going to show you a quick and easy modification to the Lodge Sportsman's Grill that will make your life easier. So stay tuned. Right, I want to show you something that kind of frustrates me about the Sportsman's Grill. Is I can't get my lid lifter in here to get these parts out when they're hot okay uh, you know if you watched our unbox video you've seen a season in this part don't bother all right it gets so hot you there's no way you can keep seasoning on that all right just uh, make sure you use it real wood good try to wipe it with oil once it's dry I just washed this one off with some water and oiled it uh, last time we used it and that'll keep the rust down on it a little bit but we want to be able to get in there and get a hold of that thing when it's hot and you see the slots are a little bit too narrow to get my lid lifter in so we're going to show you how we're going to fix that and it's the same deal with the actual uh, grill you know it's just I mean, if you can see that it's just a tiny bit too small to get that lifter down in there I like to have a place where I could grab it in the middle um, yeah, you know, other than just like this, and then it, you know, it doesn't completely hook. So let's take it to the shop, and I'll show you how to fix that. So what we did to the grill side was taking a grinder blade, grinder disc on our angle grinder, and we opened up this hole at the end. Okay, um, we just got that, put that right down through there, and now you can see this fits through very easily. So. We can now take this uh, this hook and hook right through, which where it wouldn't go before. Let me show you that when we do the other side. So just that little simple thing. Now I can reach in here on my lid lifter, get my hook all the way through. Makes it very easy to you know adjust. We can flip this thing right over now if we want to get hotter. It's big enough to get my uh, lid lifter through the hole and center it up on there. That was easy. Now you could also do this uh, manually with a rat tail file. If you have a rat tail file for metal, uh, without and no angle grinder, but rat tail file, that will do an awesome job. You could probably even do it with a regular flat file. There's, I think there's enough room between the grates to get the pass the file all the way through. Just file that out just enough you can get your lid lifter figured, and that'll help. I'm hitting that centerpiece a little too hard there. I don't want to do that. But you see it's still not quite going through. So we really want to give it pressure to the side. So no real rocket science here. All we did is made this slot wide enough for the lid lifter to go through. Okay. And that's all I need to reach in here. Get this hook through. Get that up. When it's hot, gonna work just fine. So it's back into the sportsman's grill, and you can see after that very, very small modification, now my lid lifter fits, and I can lift that right out of there. Okay, no problem. Before, you couldn't touch that thing for about, you know, several hours after it was done cooling off.